All right, guys, this is my uh, post-race video on the Coca-Cola 600. We had a pretty good race today, uh, no doubt about that. Um, the racing overall was pretty good. Saw a lot of cautions, uh, some lead changing there at the end. It was getting pretty dicey. Uh, they went four wide there at the end. Martin Truex Jr., just... A strong car and when he has a car that's working for him buddy you can bet you're gonna have a hard time getting around him great great racing with uh, my guy Chase Elliott uh, taking some bumps there from Joey Logano was able to keep it out front even after a restart uh, a couple restarts there at the end and uh, he was able to uh, to keep it out front so Chase Elliott finishing fourth, great points day, points night, I should say, for him. Just a great run for uh, Martin Truex Jr. And uh, congratulations to my buddy who's a Truex fan, uh, JB, Racing News Reviews. Go check out his page. Uh, pretty awesome guy. So congratulations to Martin Truex Jr. Uh, taking another win and uh, getting some more playoff points. Chase, really good night, fourth, so you, you know, can't complain about that, top five, I'll have to see where he's at in the overall point standings now, but uh, he's right up there with the best of the best, so good, uh, good night for him as well. Tough break for my buddy uh, Thor, Seth, another great guy you guys can go check out here on YouTube, great channel. Uh, his guy Kyle Larson, uh, just horrible breaks, uh, tough, tough breaks for this guy. Um, just tearing up a lot of cars this year, just a, a lot a lot going wrong with that team. And I think there's a lot of frustration that uh, Kyle Larson has that none of us really know about. I think uh, there's a lot of frustration with his team, how things are going. I think there's some miscommunication. I think there's a lot of things going on with that crew chief. Um, I don't know. It's just uh, it's sad to see the guy, uh, you know, win last week and then crash out in the, the 600. It's just uh, just not not cool, man. Not cool. So Thor Seth, man, I, I'm sorry, buddy. Um, but it was great to see him win the All Star race. No doubt about that. And hopefully his luck can change and he can get him a win and punch his way into the playoffs. Uh, so we'll see what happens. But anyway, guys, I thought it was overall a really great race. Let me know what you think uh, down below in the comments. Uh, I thought it was pretty good racing. I thought it was really good racing. So you guys let me know what you think down below. Again, congratulations, JB Racing News Reviews. You won this week's uh, picks contest. So shoot me uh, an email at RighteousRedneck777 at yahoo.com. Give me your address and I'll shoot the uh, diecast of your choice to you. And congratulations to your driver as well, Martin Truex Jr. for taking the uh, win tonight. So good racing guys. Next week we move on to Pocono, the tricky triangle. Can't really set up a perfect car for this track. Every corner's different, so we'll see who uh, we we'll see who's gonna be good next week. So, all right, guys. Until then, take it easy. As always, uh, click on the bell to the right to be notified of all my future videos, as well as when I go to a live stream on Tuesdays, 10:30 a.m. Central Standard Time. We talk about NASCAR and other things. So. Uh, other topics as well you can join me for the live stream so uh all right guys well, take it easy and uh hope everybody's having a good memorial day weekend stay safe out there